Welcome to another edition of Question and Answer with a Criminal Defense Attorney. I'm Mark Solomon, a defense attorney in Denver, Colorado, and today's question is about what is bribery or attempt to influence a public servant? But before we get to that, don't forget to click like and to subscribe and the uh, little bell next to it to be notified of future videos. So the question, bribery or attempt to influence a public servant, what is it? The answer is anytime you try to change a public servant's actions based on either money or threats of violence, that's going to be the felony crime. So let's take a look at that statute. So bribery. Bribery is when you actually offer some sort of financial benefit on a public servant, as in here, take some money to do something. Or this section B is when you're a public servant, if you either ask for a bribe or accept a bribe, that's, that's a bribery charge and either of those is a class three felony. Note in section two that it is no defense if, um, if the person, the public servant, has no ability to actually do what um, they're either being asked to do or what the public servant is asking for money to do. So in other words, if a police officer says, if you give me money, I will make you um, a city councilman, right? A police officer doesn't have, have the ability to do that. But if he takes money or asks for money, that's still bribery. Okay. Next question is um, attempt to influence a public servant. So same basic concept here. If you, um, through means of deceit or threat of violence or economic reprisal, um, uh, try to get the, um, the servant to do something that they otherwise wouldn't do, um, that would be the attempt to influence a public servant. And I see this um, most of the time when people are trying to um, make false documents to probation officers or they're saying something that's not true so that a police officer or a probation officer or even a judge um, or a district attorney um, does something in their case that they otherwise wouldn't do. Um, false letters of recommendation, fake letters from doctors about um, medications, that sort of thing. That would be attempt to influence a public servant. And that, not a class three felony, but it is a class four felony. So that is the um, question and answer for today. If you would like your own question answered in a future video, you can always put it in the comments below, email me, tag me on Twitter. Um, and as always, you have a right to remain silent. Um, if the police officers ask you questions about what you have, what you know, where you've been, anything, you have a right to say, I don't wanna talk to you. And if they persist, I want a lawyer.